see my butt in these shorts? Do y'all see my butt? This is why we squat. you guys my name is ariana and welcome to my youtube channel so as y'all can tell from the title your girl went to shein and we bought a whole new wardrobe of gym clothes <laughs> before we get started make sure you guys like this video subscribe to my channel if you are new and also leave me a comment down below okay so the first item that we bought is this top your girl been wearing it off camera for a while it's really really cute so as you guys can tell it's kind of like this i also have b-roll footage that i filmed for you guys so y'all can see that on the screen it's a very sexy top and i like it because i'm just now coming into my grown womanhood instagram baddie phase your girl is feeling herself and it also comes with matching leggings. They're very, very stretchy, as you guys can tell. I love the material on these, and as y'all can tell, it makes your butt look amazing. Now, I don't know about y'all, but I had to work for my little poke in the back. I had to work for it. Your girl is mostly thighs. It took me a while to grow my glutes, but your girl finally there. <laughs> but yeah, I like the waffle material, as you guys can see. I think if it's not a waffle, y'all comment down below what this is, but it looks like waffle to me, and I love it. Also, I'm going to have the prices listed on the screen of everything obviously i cannot remember the prices of every single item that i bought off the top of my head so if you guys want to purchase these exact links click the links down below i'm gonna try my best to link each product and all of that this is not sponsored your girl dropped her own coin so yeah that's how y'all know i'm not lying <laughs> trying to be productive your girl don't wash all of the light colored ones and now i have to sort through my laundry to find the order that i wore these clothes in so uh this should be fun before i show y'all the next item please make sure y'all stop this video and y'all go get a sip of water because i know half of y'all be forgetting to drink y'all water so i'm gonna be your water accountability partner and your abs will thank me later <laughs> So I changed the angle of the b-roll footage because I felt like this was way more aesthetically appealing. Let me know what y'all think down below in the comments. The second item is this crop top long sleeve shirt with the back detailing. It's very cute. I also think it's very flattering because I don't know about y'all but I'm trying to get this back looking like. Backs are like so sexy to me so with the detailing it shows off all of my hard work. Yes ma'am. Again it's stretchy. It also comes with built in cups. And if you don't have no tatas like I do, you don't have to wear a sports bra underneath this. So I really like that. It's stretchy. It feels great. Like the material is very smooth. I don't know how to describe it. But again, all the details are going to be below. Y'all can click the link and then read like the details on the shirt to see what material it's made out of. But yeah, I absolutely love this. And there's thumb holes on it. I think thumb holes are just so cute, especially when your nails are done. Oh, it's just like, yeah, we in the gym lifting super strong, but don't get it twisted. I'm still a girl. <laughs> I love that because it just, it makes you feel good about yourself, you know? Oh yeah, I almost forgot to tell y'all my sizes. So if I ordered a shirt by itself, I wear a small because I like my stuff very, very fitted. And like I said, your girl ain't got no boobies. So I don't have to worry about that. But when it comes to sets or leggings, I get a medium. Also, if you guys want to know how big I am, I am 5'5 five, five and 3 quarters. Some days I feel like 5'6, some days I say I'm 5'5. Five, five. Somewhere in there. I am approximately 140 pounds, give or take a few pounds. I'm trying to gain a little bit of muscle right now, so my goal is to get to 145. So the next item are these gray leggings. Very, very, very stretchy. I love these. They have this nice gray detailing line across the back. And as y'all can see, it's like extra, extra fabric right here. So your booty can look nice and plump. And even though there's detailing on it, once I put these on, they actually do kind of hug your thighs a little bit right below. So it kind of makes your butt look even nicer at the gym. And I noticed some girls on Instagram, whenever they're training their glutes, they will have like a band around their thighs. I guess it has to do with blood flow and girl i don't know but all i know is these make your butt look great so get them and thank me later the only negative that i can say about the majority of these clothes that i bought is if you like pockets like i like pockets we are sol and i realized that after i bought all of the clothes not complaining but i just kind of have to tweak my routine a little bit y'all 
don't come after me for this, right? So we know AirPods and wireless headphones have been out for at least five years, right? Why am I still rocking wired headphones? <laughs> I think that's the only reason why I wish these had pockets because I still use the wired Apple headphones. I've washed them in the washer, they still work. I just feel like I'm afraid to get wireless headphones because I know myself, they're tiny, and I don't wanna lose them because if I don't have my headphones at the gym, it's, it's not fun. If y'all have any suggestions on some affordable ones, like $20, $30 or less, drop them down below because I'm not trying to blow a bag on something I know I'm going to lose. So this next item, as you guys can see, I am wearing right now in the video. It's super comfortable. I have the same leggings on from the last clip, so those are not new. I really like this sweatshirt. It's a interesting fabric i don't know what it is it's definitely not your typical sweatshirt material it's still warm i don't know about y'all but i get very cold in the gym after i'm done doing my cardio i always do cardio first just because if i don't i always pull a muscle so um i have to warm up for at least 20 to 30 minutes and once i'm off the stairmaster or the treadmill normally i will put my hoodie back on just because i get very cold i don't know i've always been like that so i like rocking leggings and hoodies in the gym so if you guys like that as well, definitely get this uh, sweatshirt, not a hoodie. It's fire. I like it. Wellness. Invest in your happiness. I like the message. Why would you not get it? Like, that's all I can say. Okay, so same sweatshirt, different leggings as y'all can tell. These, again, they're the same as the gray ones I just showed you guys. I like to call these booty pants. They look pretty good. Disclaimer. My ladies, I don't know of any men who would probably rock these. Hopefully not, because I, I feel like it would squish your that area of your body <laughs> so on the back as you guys can tell right here in the crease if this is a squat day for you you can squat in these however um this might be a little tmi i don't share my gym clothes with nobody i clean my clothes so i don't wear panties or underwear at the gym why would you I I just don't see the point. Anyway, whenever you squat, these will give you a nice wedgie. It might give you a wedgie on the front as well, if you know what I'm saying. Hope you get my drift there. Again, these do not come with pockets, so that's the only con that I can say. I have literally no complaints outside of the no pockets thing. I'm so happy with all of my gym clothes. So we're on to the next pair of leggings. As you guys can see, I have on the same top from the very first set that I showed you guys. I really like these leggings because it's like a print. I'm not really a print type of person, so the fact that I bought these, I feel like I'm stepping outside of my comfort zone. And I actually do like these a lot. Again, they have the crease on the back and the line here, which will hug your thighs, I believe. These ones don't hug your thighs. This one is just detailing, my bad. But yeah, again, a mean wedgie when you squat, but your butt is going to look so good, you guys. Just buy the pants and thank me later, I'm telling you. They go all the way down to my ankles, just like the rest of the pants that I bought. And these are a really, really good material. There you go, y'all can see the detailing right there. But yeah, I really like the thickness of these. These ones seem like they would be pretty warm because I've bought leggings in the past to work out in. And some of them are thin and see-through, but not, I really, really like these. These are probably in my top three of my favorite items that I just purchased, so I love them. Now, these next pair of shorts, I know y'all see what I'm seeing. Like, do y'all see my butt in these shorts? Do y'all see my butt? This is why we squat. Oh, my butt looks amazing. I ain't gonna lie, these do look a little weird <laughs> when you're not wearing them just because it's like, it looks like a deflated butt. Hilarious. Again, it has the line, the crease thing in the middle, the wedgie, that's what we gonna call it. It has the wedgie in the middle. Also, another thing I want to note with the majority of these leggings that I showed you, as well as the shorts, this band here is top tier. Like, it feels so good. It's not too loose to where you don't feel like you're snatched like it would a waist trainer but it's not as tight as a waist trainer so to me these are perfect because they're comfortable they're not pinching it's not uncomfortable you can literally get a really really good workout in these and the other part that i like this is gonna be tmi again <laughs> so your girl be sweating right <laughs> at the gym on my butt so I'll also get sweat right in this region where your legs meet, right? I don't know why. I'm pretty sure everybody else sweats there too, but it's just annoying whenever you're wearing leggings and you done doing cardio and it looks like you peed yourself. I don't like that. So I like the fact that at least the leggings I wore this morning at the gym, my butt sweat wasn't showing as much as it normally does with some of the other cotton material that I will wear at the gym. If you're wearing cotton at the gym, baby, 
<laughs> they gonna see all the sweat. I really, 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 really appreciate that because it makes me less self-conscious at the gym. I don't like people seeing my butt sweat, but at the same time, you know why we here. The other thing I like about these pants is that around my thighs, like I told y'all, my thighs are like huge. It's all hamstring and quad, it's just muscle. Normally, whenever I buy leggings or workout pants, if they're shorts, normally it will cut off my thigh. Like, kind of how you can see on these. Like, y'all see that? Annoying. So I'm happy that these shorts don't really do that on me. Shit. Like I told y'all, out of everything that I purchased, I loved everything except for this item that y'all see on the screen. These are the shorts that I'm currently wearing. I don't hate them, however, I will not be wearing these to the gym because the material is a little bit thinner than the rest of the clothes that I bought, like the leggings. And your girl be like splitting at the gym, or trying to anyway, squatting, deadlifting, and like I said, I don't be wearing no panties. So... Y'all really think I'm about to be out here bad like that? No, I will be doing yoga in my house <laughs> with these shorts on because I just think they're a little bit too revealing for me to be comfortable. Also, as y'all can see with the B-roll footage, it's like, why are they that high-waisted? Like, I could literally pull it up and it'll be like a romper situation. I don't know why they're that high. I'm gonna have to check the details again on the shorts. And even if I were to fold it down, y'all can see the tag in the back is exposed. Show. I don't know what that's about, but we're gonna give these six and a half out of 10. I don't hate them, but I can't use them for what I bought them for. So, womp womp. Y'all seeing what I'm seeing with this next set? <laughs> Who, back looking strong with the booty pants. I love it, I love it. So let's start off with this top, right? I believe it's a... Okay, so there is padding built into it. So your girl gonna be rocking this as a bra. I'm not wearing anything underneath it. Cause why? We ain't got no boobies. You know, this is just a little... Me being a little bougie, a little picky, right? I like wearing stuff up top in a size small. And I like wearing stuff in my legs. Medium. And that's why I think it's annoying. Like whoever builds these websites, I wish there was a feature to where you could pick like what size top you want as well as what size bottom you want. But I do realize on the back end that is a lot more work and it's annoying whoever is the website builder. So I feel you, but I don't feel you at the same time, you know what I mean? So the top is a medium and because I don't have any boobs, I would prefer it to be a little bit tighter. It does still fit, but it's not fitted like I like for it to be. Like I need it to be like strapped to my chest because I like my stuff tight. Because if I want to run sprints, Ain't got time for it to be bouncing around. So we ain't got time for that. Again, these leggings are actually very similar to the brown ones and the other gray ones that I showed you guys with the detailing, the line on the side. And in the back, it does, it's really light, but it does have the little gray detailing on the back of the legs. So this one does make your butt look really good. I don't really know if y'all can tell on camera, but the color of it is almost like a gray, blue, blue, gray, something like that. So it's really, really pretty. I do like the fact that your back is out. You get to see all of my hard work and it makes your butt look nice. So just know you want me getting some looks at the gym in this one. <laughs> Ooh, another thing before I forget, because your girl don't be wearing underwear at the gym, uh, y'all will kind of be able to see the print. If you know what print I'm talking about. Feel free to use your imagination. I don't necessarily care because if you looking at me that hard in the gym, sir, ma'am, let me work. Baby, when I tell you when I put this pink on, oh, I'm in love. I look so pretty in pink. Look at me. Oh, I love this set. It's giving she's athletic. I love it. Like it's so cute across the front. The waistband, it sucks your abs in. The top is cute. It has thumb holes. Like girl, we have absolutely no complaints. The back detailing is cute. Oh, even on the pants, on the butt part, like the little detailing right here, it makes your butt look like a little heart. So it's like, yes, baby, you gonna love this. <laughs> Even on the calf muscles, the detailing here, what, I don't know what y'all call this, lattice? Lattice work? I, I don't know, correct me if I'm wrong. But yes, I love this set because, again, I get cold at the gym. So the long sleeve, the leggings, I absolutely love this set. Between this one and the black one, I don't know. I don't know because that pink, y'all gonna see me squatting 205 today. <laughs> y'all gonna see me. Oh, hold on y'all, the, the fro. 
the fro ain't froing no more. So with this next one, I don't really know how to feel. When I first put it on, I was like, ooh, she's giving like dark superhero vibes. Like, I think I would need to buy a pair of leggings that goes well with this top because I don't know. I just feel like it's not feminine enough for the vibes that I'm going for. It feels good. It's like a dry fit, regular, like fitted shirt. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know how to feel about this one. So, eh. Now this next shirt, we love it. This material is definitely top tier. I love this. This feels like really good quality gym material. However, I didn't know that it was going to be this fitted. I probably would have gotten a medium in this because as y'all can see on the front. Now this is just me being picky again. But from a front view, I have abs. So why is it pushing out on the sides? What is that? <laughs> I work hard for my abs. So I don't have time for this shirt to make me look bad. <laughs> But I do like the back detailing on it. Um, I don't know what this little piece is. Like we need to, we need to address this. I know y'all can see it in the shot. I'm probably just gonna have to like snip it off. I do like the shirt. It came with thumb holes as well. Again, popping. But I just kind of wish I would have sized up a little bit because it would make me feel a little bit more comfortable. It was a struggle to get this shirt over my hair. My God. I know y'all are thinking, Ari, how many pairs of gray leggings did you buy, girl? <laughs> I didn't realize I had as many in my cart <laughs> when I placed my order. But yeah, I mean, I needed them. And as you guys can tell, these ones are a different wash. They're a little bit lighter. Again, it has the little kind of sort of built-in waist trainer. I like how it feels on my body. I know it's kind of light on camera, but as you guys can tell, it has the little booty thing, the wedgie thing again. And right here, there is like this. Y'all see how the print is a little bit different? So like the line is like right here. I don't know what this is, but it's just a nice little detailing to the pants so it's not just all plain. I like them. Again, ain't no pockets, but y'all see how it's fitting on the body? Like we're giving. So I'm just gonna have to suck it up and buy me some wireless headphones because why no y'all see this jacket? This jacket, fire. I probably will wear a bra with this one though. Only because your girls is not, it's not sitting the way that we need her to. But I just be at the gym, I don't really care. Like this jacket is so, so cute. I like it zipped up. Like once I zip it up, I feel like, okay, it's beast mode. The pre-workout has kicked in, let's get it. <laughs> and then if you zip it down, it's just like, oh, I see you over there with the little decolletage. Sitting, the collarbones looking nice and highlighted the material of this jacket is similar to that purplish purplish burgundy shirt that i just showed y'all it's very thick so if you guys live somewhere cold or y'all just be freezing y'all butt off in the gym like i do i would definitely recommend getting this jacket it doesn't come with thumb holes but that's okay i'm not gonna complain now y'all see this set this is the set that i wore this morning to the gym my butt was sitting girl i was looking so good at the gym it was leg day or whatever Whew, girl i was looking at my butt the whole time while i was working out i felt great when i was squatting again wedgie major wedgie this is why i know that all the other pants is gonna give me a wedgie too no pockets but y'all see like on the back the line detailing across the back of the thigh when i was at the gym like i could notice like my what is that hamstring meat <laughs> I don't know what to call it, but it was like almost hanging over that line. But I don't know if that's just a me problem or anybody else with really thick thighs problem. I'm going to insert some footage from my workout from this morning. So as you guys can see, I wore it with the burgundy crop thing I'm about to show y'all in a minute. But I love this set. Like no complaints. I felt amazing at the gym. My legs were not cold when I walked outside. So that's a major plus because this morning I think it was like, it was frost on my car. So I know it was cold, at least like 30 something. And my legs were not cold at all. It actually felt kind of like I had sweatpants on. I didn't really notice a difference. So that is a major plus, especially coming from me because I'm always cold. But yeah, nice razorback detailing across the back of the bra. Like, oh man, y'all, I have no complaints about this set. I felt so good at the gym. I'm gonna have to wear this without a hoodie one day, maybe in the summer, whenever it's back day. Out here looking strong. Oh, I love it. I know y'all see my little back muscles coming in. 
As I stated before, sometimes I get cold at the gym and a lot of times whenever I'm not filming for Instagram content, I get cold and I throw my hoodie on once I'm towards like the end of my workouts. And so I just bought this little hoodie. It says Freedom. I just kind of liked the font and the fact that it was a black hoodie with white font. It's just like, you know, just a simple little graphic sweatshirt. I don't really have a lot of those, so I'm going to add this to my collection. I can rock this around the house when I'm just chilling or if I'm at the gym putting in that work. This one feels more like a typical sweatshirt material versus this one. This one, I, I don't know what to call this. It really just feels like a marshmallow, but this one is more what I'm familiar with. I think it's cotton on the inside, so yeah, it's nice and warm. I really like this. So with that set, I was just showing y'all the taupe colored set. I couldn't show y'all that because that's in the dirty clothes. And with this red crop, thingy that y'all see on the screen. I can't show y'all that either because that thing is like super sweaty. <laughs> That's in a dirty clothes too. But yeah, as y'all saw with the footage of me working out, it's long enough, it's functional. You can still have your back out so you can still get a breeze if you need it. It feels like a typical sweatshirt material, kind of like the black freedom hoodie I just showed you guys. No complaints, it's fire, I like it. It's super simple. It adds to any outfit if you are one of those people that goes to the gym and you don't like to necessarily just be walking around with a sports bra on. So if you're one of those people who's a little bit more self-conscious with working out or going to the gym to work out, if you're not comfortable rocking a sports bra and shorts like a lot of the IG baddies be rocking, I completely understand. In my opinion, I would say buy some high waist leggings and a crop sweatshirt or hoodie because the waistband on the leggings will keep everything nice and tight for you. And you can also wear a waist trainer on top of that if you really that self-conscious about it. But it just, it gives, your, gives you a nice little frame, you know? what I mean so that's the vibe that I'm going for especially with the little ankle socks it's so cute it's a banger don't worry y'all we almost done we only got like two or three more items left now this black shirt baby I absolutely love this shirt I know y'all see the front is very basic but I like the fact that it's a wider neck it's more feminine more girly versus like a crew neck it's long enough now the only thing ain't no thumb holes if this shirt had thumb holes 10 out of 10. But I know y'all see what my back looking like. Y'all see that? The back detailing is just mm, amazing. Got your girl looking nice and fit and strong. I love this. I'm gonna have to start buying clothes more often. The material on this shirt is not quite dry fit. It's like spandex-y. It's not like 100% spandex though, but I don't really know what it is. Again, all the details is down below in the description box and you should be able to click the links to the products. But yeah, I really like the feel of this shirt because if you sweat a lot, nobody's gonna be able to tell, but I probably, I ain't gonna lie though. I have noticed people who wear dry fit clothes after a certain amount of wears, maybe like three to four months of wearing the same dry fit clothes to the gym, your gym does kind of start to hold a smell. I don't know how to like, prevent that if somebody knows please drop the tip down below in the comments because i don't like having to get rid of gym clothes that are real cute if i don't have to but i do need to figure out how to get the sweat out of some stuff i've noticed it on some of my clothes as well as some people who be at the gym i ain't naming no names but gentlemen young men ladies don't like it when you at the gym smelling funky so please figure out how to make your clothes smell good all right Thank you, that, that was the PSA for the day. So this next item, as you guys can tell, it looks very, very similar to the red cropped sweatshirt that I just showed you guys. That's because it is. It's real cute. I really like how it feels. It's not quite as thick as a sweatshirt. It's more lightweight, but it's still a sweatshirt material for sure, but it's just not like a super heavy one. I really like it. Like you can probably get away with wearing this in the springtime. Maybe if it's like 70 degrees outside. I don't know. I'm from Florida. So if it's anything below like 65, it's cold. So yeah, I can rock this in the summer with some shorts at the gym. Probably like them tan shorts that I showed you guys at the closer to the beginning of this video. Definitely we'll pair this together because y'all see how the blue is looking with the taupe grayish color. Yeah, that's definitely a standout at the gym. It's really cute. So I like these. I'm probably going to order more of these. I'm going to have to look back on the site to see if they carry this in more colors than what I ordered because I absolutely love these. So we are on to the last item. I hope you guys are still watching because I know this video is probably going to be kind of long. Yeah, so this next set, 
I don't know. I was feeling a little froggy whenever we were shopping. Again, I don't really order that many prints. I'm more so a nudes, basics, Yeezy Kim K type of chick. I like stuff like that because it's easy to pair stuff together. But I went out on a limb. I do like how these leggings fit. This waistband is like a very weird material. It's ribbed. Well, let me show you this side. Can y'all see? Like, it's ribbed for sure, but it's not like... Girl, I don't know. Y'all just have to order it. Like, y'all can hear it. Like, So it's ribbed, but it's like smooth at the same time. I don't think I've ever felt a material that's like that. I do like it because when I'm wearing it, my abs definitely feel like super sucked in. Looks really nice. And on the butt, as you guys can tell, again, the little wedgie thing is there. So your booty is going to look nice in these as well. Oh, it also has it also has ribbed material, the same as the waistband. It has it on the ankles. It's stretchy, as you guys can tell. Pretty much all of these items that I showed you guys are stretchy, except for maybe that burgundy-ish shirt. But that may be because it was too small. I don't, I don't know. Come on, fro. I need you to keep froing. My hair keeps shrinking. Again, another one of the complaints is the fact that whenever you order a set, you have to order the same size. So the bra, it fits as y'all can see, but is it super tight like I like it? No, it's not loose though, but it's just not like, like super tight. Oh, that tongue pop was kind of good. <laughs> the bra is a razorback design as you guys can see. And it also has a little peekaboo cutout in the middle. It's very cute, very flattering. It makes your back look nice. And it even has the same ribbed material on the bra as well. It's a very good set though. I like the set. I'm just not used to seeing myself in prints. So we're going to have to get used to that, but I do like it. It's a very pretty blue. So after about $300 later, as you guys saw, those are the items that I bought. I really, really like them. If you guys purchase any of these items, I'm sorry, I don't have no code for y'all because again, this is not a sponsored video. Hopefully in the future, let's put that out there into the universe. God, sponsorship, she in sponsorship. Let's, let's see how that goes because if they sponsor your girl, I'm gonna be so happy because those gym clothes are fire. Like the sets are affordable. I have no complaints. Like I'm super happy. I got all of those clothes for less than $300. Obviously with they coupon code, but just thank me later. Y'all are gonna be so happy if y'all purchase some of these sets. So if you guys have made it to the end of the video, please again, make sure that you subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Turn on that notification bell. Also give this video a big, big thumbs up. And lastly, leave me a comment down below. Thanks again for watching and I will see you guys in my next video.